Hi, Lorraine Menza here, and in this video blog, I'm going to talk about your thoughts become your reality. I was listening to Dr. Wayne Dyer, one of my favorite all-time people. I went on YouTube and was listening to some of his his uh, his forever wisdom, as I call it, um, and PBS calls it too. Uh, he just, you know, he just hits the nail on the head every time. Are you the kind of person that needs a gold star? Like when you were younger and you did good on a paper and the teacher gave you a gold star? Do you need people to say that they like you or that they are going to do what you do? Do you need material things? Do you need to have an excess of clothes or an excess of things? Maybe you have to have the best car. or Maybe you have to have so many grocers in your house even though you may not use all of them. Do you believe in what you do? Or do you have to have other people believe in what you do? do I mean, do, do other people's opinions matter of you more than your own? And if you answered yes to a certain set of these questions, it's really time to start thinking about taking control of your own life. Don't let your past define you. A lot of times, the past, people have said we aren't good at something that, you know, that we were doing or they made some comment and we let it hold us back from what we really want to do. So if you find that you're not hanging around with people that are more motivating and, and approve, I mean, I guess we don't want to get into the approval, but you know, you want to hang around with more like-minded people, not people that have to approve everything that you're doing. So how do you do that? Well, you got to change your thoughts. You got to change the way you, you think and you got to get rid of some of the past, the past things that have held you back. Do you remember the old 80-20 rule? Like, um, and let's let's uh, put this with clothes. You know, if you look at your closet, you probably only wear 20% of everything that's in there. The other 80% you are you're not using. So get learn to get rid of the excess, the things that you don't use, or the things that the 80% maybe that you're allowing to rule your thoughts that are no good for you. Get rid of those. Get rid of that and push it out of the way and allow for good thoughts to, to form. Learn to be flexible. And if you think about it, water is so flexible and soft. We are made of 75% of water. But a lot of times we become stiff. We become um, stiff from all the rules we make. Remember this saying, the more rules you make, the more rule breakers you create. And I like this saying because that's so true as a parent if you don't learn to let go and let your kids learn that they have the capacity to 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 do things to to um to uh avoid conflict or get out of conflict you have to let your kids learn and so must you um when we talk about you know life life should you should be more fluid water seeps into everything and it's soft and you need to be more like that more flexible a flexibility is the companion of life, or stiffness is the companion of death. If you ever to walk in grass, it's very soft and it's flexible, and it comes, it can spring back up after you've walked on it. Where dead grass is brown and it's stiff, and you want to be more flexible in your life. So, if you want to change the way you think and you want a new reality, or you want a new reality, you need to change the way you think. And you need to do that by getting out of the fear and thinking of things as being curious. Getting, you know, not being afraid of going out what you want to go after. That's so important. So keep this in mind. Get rid of the attachment of having to own certain things and many things. Maybe you just get rid of the excess. Start, And that includes what's here in your head and in your brain. And learn to be more flexible in life. And I really believe if you start making these small, small little changes along the way, create big ones in the end. And with that said, hopefully you found value and click like if, if you uh, did. Leave a comment and click on the link below because we can always change our lives. Take care.